YouTube is always making changes, and uh, they're not always for the better. One of the things I like to do is listen to music while I code, and uh, there used to be a way to hit the videos thing and play all videos on the channel. You could just let it go. I've got YouTube Premium so I can listen to a bunch of music ad-free, have some videos, just have some stuff up there on the screen, and that feature is gone, so let's fix it. If you don't care about coding at all, I do have chapters in this video, so at the very end you can click on the chapter and see how you can use this tool without caring how it was made. So we're not going to spend a ton of time on this, but as you can see here, I've made a little card that says Fix YouTube Play All. Enter a link of one video from the channel that you want to play and go. Now we're not going to use the YouTube API, we're not going to do anything too fancy. I'll show you how it works. So I've made something here that is very, very basic. We have a very basic bootstrap page. As you can see, we've got some columns going on. We've got a header and a card. Uh, we're saying YouTube play fix all and we're going to enter one single field and that field is the video uh, from a channel that you want to play and then we're going to hit go and then we're going to continue with the rest of our normal bootstrappy stuff. So let me get some PHP going and I'll show you how it works. Okay, so the first thing I did was add a little bit of cross-site request forgery protection so that you all can't turn my site into an API. Um, it'll just protect you where you actually have to be on my page to submit this form. But uh, the real magic happens after you post a link. And let me show you what's going on here. So we've got our little uh, CSRF protection up here. Then we are going to grab the video URL that you gave us. And so the first thing we we'll want to do is make sure that it's a YouTube video because we are going to be fetching it. So we don't want to just download giant pages and crash the server and stuff like that. So we're checking to make sure that it is a, uh, a valid URL. If that doesn't happen, we're just gonna redirect and I'll show you how that works. Uh, now what we're actually doing is we are grabbing the YouTube page itself. So we're gonna fetch the entire YouTube page. And what we're doing is we're looking for uh, YouTube channel UC in the uh, actual HTML of the page. And that's how we're gonna get the actual channel ID. Now, if we find it, um, what's a little weird is that in order to generate that play all, we need to replace this UC with a UU. And so you can see we're gonna do that right here. We're gonna take that channel ID. If we find it, we're going to um, replace the UC with UU. And then we're going to just redirect to that page. And you see we're doing a list with this modified channel ID right here. And then we're dying. Otherwise, we're just going to say that we can't find the channel ID. And so uh, let me show you how that works here. So as you can see, I have my page. And I'm going to post a link of any video from the channel. Now, I'm going to break the link and just make it HTTPSS. And so when I do that, I get a little invalid URL. Please enter a valid URL. But if I enter a real URL, then when I click this button, it is going to silently download this YouTube page. It's going to search the text of the HTML. It's going to find the link for the channel that owns this video. It's going to change the link from UC to UU. And then it's going to redirect to that page with a list on there. So check this out. It's going to take a second and I'm going to pause it so we're not actually doing any copyright violations here. But as you can see, we have YouTube watch and then we have list equals UU and the channel ID of this channel. So if I open it up, you'll see that we have every video that they have uploaded right here. And so we've got all 549 of their videos that are public and that is how we do that. All right, so I have no idea how long this site will stay up, but I will give you the code so that you can put it back up if it does go down. It is on the cheapest web host possible. All you do is you paste the video of uh, any video on the channel that you wanna see all the videos off, and you hit the go button. It will download the page What's and it everyone? will load them. And all of a sudden, you'll get all 325 of Connor Maynard's videos, should you ever want that. So uh, there you go. I hope you find this useful. Have a great day.